Hello Lola's, welcome back to my channel guys. First of all, as you can tell, I'm practically losing my voice. So, um, bear with me. But I wanted to record this video. Um, I don't know when I will upload it, but I wanted to have it. Because this is the first time that I've ordered such product from MacPherson. One thing I will say about MacPherson is, baby, what they're going to do is get you your product fast in a hurry. This is not to promote them, but I am just saying I appreciate it as a collector and as an artist. So let's move on. Get this out. I want to give out my information. The only thing I have done was I tried to hopefully remove anything that would disclose my personal information. And so, okay. I don't know what to expect. But guys, if you're subscribed to not subscribe to this channel go ahead and subscribe now if you're already subscribed thank you so much for your support give this video a thumbs up don't forget to share this video also guys if you're not aware i do have a paid channel membership we refer to it as the chatterbox you'll see a join now button or the link is in the description bar and i'll move right on forward with this because i really want to get to this and see what it's like okay oh wow all right so we have a coa and I'm not going to make you guys wait. It is Sarah Silicones and Antonio Sanchez. All right. I guess that is the COA. I will have to file that. It also has a body. I will look at that in a minute. I am so excited. Look at this. I don't know if you guys can you guys see that. All right. I have never gotten silicone from them before. So um, Chrissy pours this silicone kit. So it'll be my first time seeing Christy pour um, of silicone. This is handmade with love. Okay. Very, very cute. I like the way it's bundled up here. Um, the box actually smells really good. So presentation is definitely cute. Okay. So all right, let's move, make sure. No, I just had a baby that I was rooting on this table, so let me sure. All right, so this is an arm. This allows me to be able to look at the actual pour. Right. This part right here don't matter, because that's gonna be inside the cloth so. okay the color doesn't seem to be a bad color so it's, it's a bit it's not as neutral, but it's not like super, super dark. Let's see, I'm looking at this. I love this, this arm. Okay. Sorry, guys, if I'm a little. Um, if I'm taking my time. All right, so it's Ecoflex 20, light skin, full limbs. Um, some instructions here. All right, tells you what to do to get started. Some of you guys might actually want me to read that, and I, I can read it for you guys. Oh, so this is another hand. Something in here smells very scented. Um, it's me sniffing the silicone. Okay. It's a very smooth pour. All right. All these fingers are loose. I like that they already have rings on it. That's really nice. Look at those fingers. Oh wait, you guys can't see. Nice long fingers. Oh, beautiful hand. Just, oh, 
I'm looking forward to seeing what I can do with this. I am not a partial person, so I always worry, but oh man, this hand is beautiful. So far, so good. I was This is the leg. Okay. Oh, nice chunky leg. Okay. So it's a nice smooth pour, like I said. Um, the color, like I said, the color is is a little darker. Then I usually this this to me this color kind of almost looks like what some people would start as a biracial pour or something, but it doesn't have a gray hue. Hold on, hold on. I'm gonna open the windows. I'm trying to because I want to give an accurate review. I don't want to be like so. I'm just trying to. Yeah, so it's not a super light pour. But it's not, it's not bad. I, don't, I have to see what I, what it paints like to you know, really, but I'm kind of glad that it's actually this color pour because I do intend on giving this baby quite a bit of color because I'm hoping that this baby will replace another baby for me. So, and I'm actually, I'm excited because I was worried about the knees on this one. And so I am not mad at the knees. Look at that. That's so cute. All right. Really fat little feet. This is a fat baby. It's a chunky baby. Now, let me read this to you guys really quick before I open the head up. It says, please remember to thoroughly wash and prep your silicone kit before painting. Even though each kit is washed by, washed by the pourer, there still can be traces of release mold, oils from hands, or even dust particles from travel still on your kit. Any traces of these can inhibit paint. Failure to properly prep the kit is the responsibility of the buyer slash painter. To prep your piece, wipe down with acetone, then thoroughly with Dawn Stish soap and rinse with hot water. Last, do a quick pass of 99% acetyl alcohol or Novox gloss if you suspect release agent still on it. Look closely for any lint, remaining soaps, or release agent residue. Repeat the steps if necessary. It is better to spend extra time cleaning your piece than to not have paint cure due to properly prepping it. Okay. So those are her instructions. Everybody use different things. Hold on, let me see if I can do this a little bit or down. There we go. Everybody use different things um, to on what they, how they prep their kits and all that stuff. So at least they give some people some type of direction. This color is actually not bad. Um, like I said, it's a little darker than what I sometimes paint from, but I think I have some kits that's actually the same color. So I'm not, I'm not mad at it. Okay, here goes the face. <laughs> I'm nervous about the face. I don't know if it's fully open or not. Or if the mouth is closed and I have to open it because the pictures on the site can be confusing sometimes when they show them completed because you know the artists sometimes have already opened the mouth and you're not sure so okay so I thought the mouth was a little open but it's not it is completely closed so I thought it was already opened a little bit. 
um, because of some of the pictures, which makes it, once it's a little bit open, it makes it a little bit easier to actually open. But it's okay. I like the head shape. Um, ears are okay. So yeah, I'll have to spend some time and try to open the mouth. But I do love that it has the, um, that it has the, um, neck rings already on it. That's, you know, that's, that's a great thing. Um, so I don't have to search for ones to fit. Um, I don't know, like it's a little... Like this part, I, maybe that was a repair that was done, I don't know. But it's like a little dry spot there or something. But it should be fine when painting. Um, yeah, I'm not sure how I'll do with this color, but we're going to find out. Um, or this pour itself. But we'll find out. So, overall, I, from what I see right now, I really like it. Um, you know, the only thing that I, that I always say is that I wish that people would have open mouths with the kids. That's the only reason why I have never really bought from MacPherson anyway with the kids because a lot of them, the mouths are all, are closed. But, it's okay. I am going to give it a shot. And we're going to go from there. But this is a cute fat kit. And I actually, I'm excited to see where it ends up. This is the body. I do not want to get this body mixed up with any other body. I'm going to open this body so we can have an idea. And I'm going to put it back in that bag so that I don't lose track of it. I mean, get it mixed up with, you know, like other bodies here because I have so many bodies. Okay. All right, so this is the body that came with it. I think it's supposed to be like a 21-inch baby. So, I don't know if this was going to work out for me. This baby I bought because I was thinking this baby would replace Logan. And so I'm actually pretty happy with it. And I I think a lot of people don't think about MacPherson when you think about silicone kits. But I love, like I said, the professionalism of the company itself of how they get stuff out right away. You don't have to wait. You don't have to deal with politics, you know, you don't have to be friends with this person or connected to that person for them to sell to you. They don't care if you don't like this person in the community or that person in the community. Like there's no like personal comp, you know, politics going on. It's just like walking into a brick and mortar and just seeing what you like and getting it. So as long as your cart don't go decline when you put it in their cart, you're good to go. <laughs> and I think their kits are pretty affordable. And this silicone feels pretty nice. It's pretty squishy. It's soft. Um, I think her pour is really smooth. So I really love that. That's all that really matters to me the most. And it doesn't seem to be really translucent. There is some areas that are... Whoa. I don't think it's translucent. But I... Sorry. All right. Yeah, this is... This is going to be a really nice partial baby. Oh my gosh. And chunky. Oh my goodness. 
This is great. So shout out to Chrissy for a great pour. And um, shout out to Matt Pearson for getting me my kit like within a day <laughs> or two. I mean, it was like really quick. I wasn't expecting it this soon. But anyway, once again, oh my gosh, I just love this open hand. This is so amazing. I love this baby. I love the face on this baby. This baby is going to be so beautiful. I hope I can really get it done. And I'm actually, the more and more I spin with the actual color, I'm actually really glad that it start out this color because it's not dark. Um, because, let me see if I could grab a, I'm going to grab a silicone studio kit head. <clears throat> It's not, like I said, it's, it's not, it's actually lighter enough for me to see, yeah, it's good. It's light enough for me to be able to, yeah, okay, that's perfect. Okay, so I've painted from this. I can still add nice undertones to it. That's why I like to start from like Caucasian blend because it helps me start from, you know, build my color up. Versus when the pour is really dark, it changes the build up. So I'm super excited about it. So that is it. I'm going to get this uploaded. I won't probably release this until after I have it painted um, and rooted. Um, because I don't, this is going to be my surprise addition to my collection. So. All right, guys. Thanks for watching. Bye-bye.